You guys ready for a physics lesson? Yes. Yeah. Can, I, I, can I just assume the question is, what the heck, Kels? Right? Yeah, that's... <laughs> okay, so we're actually... 15 is the perfect time for a physics lesson. Yes. Why not? Why not? Mm -hmm. We're talking about mir mirages, and not the kind of mirage you see in a desert, though it would happen for the same type of reason. This one actually coming to us from Calgary, Alberta, uh, actually just north of the city in Airdrie. You want to take a look? Look at that. There's a mirage happening on the horizon. If you look yeah. at the bottom of the screen, you can see the houses. Yeah. And then that flickering that's happening in the atmosphere, yeah. that's an actual mirage. So here's what happens. Okay. A physics lesson being that light traveling through air of different temperatures will react differently. Now, our brain and our eyes want to think that air travels the same through all temperatures yeah. or light travels the same through all temperatures. That doesn't actually happen. The light will bend towards the denser air. Now, colder air is that denser air. Now, what happened in that situation that you saw, if we can bring back up the video in Airdrie, we had a temperature inversion. So we had warmer air uh, sitting a little bit higher up in the atmosphere. We had cold air right at the surface. So that light as it's traveling towards our eyes is going to bend down towards the surface. It's going to make whatever's at the surface stretch upwards, so wow. looking a little bit bigger. Now, you notice how it's kind of uneven? Yeah. So that is actually called a fata morgana, which means that it's not necessarily a uniform temperature gradient right across the atmosphere. It's a little bit different. So you're getting uh, not necessarily the same light bending in all different directions. So you get kind of the waving can, back and forth. Can I just say, so cool, it is Kels. so cool. It is, I love how you said, you know, I know our brains are, are, are wondering, does light travel differently through different temperature areas? Uh, it's never occurred to me to ask that question. <laughs> Like, ever. That's I've, what you got me for. Yeah. I've only ever seen, like, mirages in the Flintstones and stuff. I've never actually mm -hmm. seen one. This yeah. is very cool, Kelsey. So, real quick, I know we have to go, but in the, you know, in the summertime when it looks like there's water on the road yes. up ahead? Mm -hmm. So, that's a different type of mirage. Yeah. That's when you have hot, hot air at the surface, colder air above. So, the, the light is uh, that's coming from the sun is bending and looking like it's reflecting at the surface. Mm -hmm. Very right. cool, Kelsey. Yeah. Hey, thanks for watching. If you liked this, be sure to subscribe here, or you can check out more Your Morning videos right here.